Hey guys, my name is Liz. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before, I am a single mom and I share my life with you uh, pretty much raw and unfiltered. So if you're interested in seeing that, let's go. So it's like 6.53. I'm folding some laundry out here. This was like an essay. Folding laundry, 6.53. You know, I'm just thinking about stuff. I kind of have some cramps this morning. So guys, um, I hope you're enjoying the video so far. Um, this is what I was doing this morning, a bunch of laundry and stuff. You know, I was doing a little editing, little this, little that, you know, you know. And uh, yeah, you guys are in for a quite a vlog today. That's all I'll say. Hi, Precious. How are you? How are you, baby? You woke up. Good morning. Okay, guys. Cooking some food here. I don't know. Where, where's my spatula? Crap, I feel like I don't know where my spatula is. Where did I put all my silverware? All my... I'm all right. You hungry? Crawling over here, guys. She, she smells it. You hungry? You miss mommy's breakfast? Guys, Jorge literally used to make me... If I didn't, he would definitely be mad. He used to have to have his breakfast like asap in the morning that would literally be the first thing that i had to do before i even did anything to myself because if i didn't he would be calling me saying that he was hungry and everything so i just made it a part of my day i just made it a part of my daily routine that i make him breakfast and i made him a homemade breakfast like every day guys and this dude would make me feel bad if like one day I was like not feeling good or something like that for not making him breakfast, like, or tired. This dude would really like make me feel bad. I just, I'm so glad I don't have to deal with that anymore to be really quite honest. And you guys know that, but yeah, it's not fair. Like, I don't agree with that. Like, of course I wanted to cook for my husband. Like, you know what I mean? But he just took it to a whole nother level of demanding. Felt like I definitely was the person who always needed to cook. Like it was, it was just messed up. Yeah. We Go. Yummy. So guys, I'm just truth. filling up my meds and um, watching a YouTube logical, video and sensible. looking at my adorable little baby maybe who wants more food. So guys, I was on my game this morning, and I'm going to tell you this. I'm not like that every day, guys, so I'm not perfect, okay? Nobody's perfect, but, you know, I have been trying my best lately. So, um, well, I've been trying my best for a while, but lately I've been trying my very f***ing best. So, um, yeah, guys, enjoy the rest of the video. Thank you for watching. So me and Amor are about to go uh, take a ride, right? We're gonna go do some stuff. Finished up in here. Now we're gonna go. Me and Amor are in Giant Eagle. And <laughs> we just walked in and she's seen this other baby over there. She's like still, they walked away, but she's like still looking where that other baby went. <laughs> so guys, I'm getting some of these pomegranates. These are like one of the best fruits in the world and if you look it up I'm I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to google it now but I'm pretty sure they're like one of the most healthiest fruits that there is so yeah let's get some of those and they never they they don't have them all the time either so when I see them I get them got some cotton candy grapes oh my I just remembered I got these the one time and they're so freaking good dude like really good like like really good i'm in here and giant eagle looking crazy guys and you know what i don't care i don't care i'm gonna get this one i never tried this one before is that like real like hmm all stuff that I'm gonna keep walking right by. What the heck are those? The heck? Little sandwiches, huh? That's interesting. They got some, they got some like very, ooh, a cheese advent calendar. Girl, what are you trying to do? Girl, you can't have that. Oh my lord. Oh, she's about to have a breakdown now. <laughs> oh boy. Um, I'm more a star. You can't have those, honey. They're grapes. I could choke on that, so. Okay. 
getting some of these minute rice with butter and sea salt. Um, the kids love these, especially Sophie. She loves those. And they only take a minute in the microwave, guys. And they literally, if you guys have never had these before, they taste really good. You would not know. You would really not know that that was, um, you know, microwave rice. And I'm going to tell you that because I made it for Jorge. And I'm not, I'm, I don't know. Maybe, maybe you guys won't think so. I mean, I think it tastes good, but... Um, I made it for Jorge the one time and he was like, and he ate it. He did. He thought that I made it myself. He was like, who taught you how to make that? And I was like, boy, that was some minute rice. White grape apple juice. You know what? Apple white grape. Yeah, this has a lot less sugar in it. So guys, I'm in the bathroom and I had no choice, but I didn't want to take her out and do all this. So I just brought the whole cart in here, guys. over here just getting my bacon and why? why 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 would you that just doesn't sound right i don't know so we're in the checkout lane we got this packed we got it packed <laughs> Amor is trying to communicate with the janitor at Johnny. <laughs> she is. <laughs> you are so funny, Amora. Guys, so I'm like about to check out a giant eagle so guys i have not smoked or i have not vaped any medicinal marijuana at all today okay guys how do i feel pretty good surprisingly um have i been thinking about it yes constantly um i'm trying to forget i'm praying that i can do this I just checked my Facebook and somebody just messaged me about the bed. So, um, it's good <laughs> because I think they're going to come by it. And I think they're going to meet me right now, basically right after I get the heck on out of here. So, um, yeah, that's really good because I need to get that out of Bubba's room. because It's like taking up a lot of space and I'm ready to say goodbye to that bed. Screw that bed. You're very curious, huh? I'm not using I'm not using Jorge's perks anymore, guys. <laughs> Alright guys. Son of a If you guys are interested in watching the grocery haul, I did a live stream. It is a members only live stream. So just go into my YouTube channel, click live, and then um, you should be able to see there should be a star next to it. Um, so guys, I'm on my way to Country Fair. Actually, Country Fair is right there. Jorge is already over there. Let's see what happens. Let's, let's hope nothing crazy happens, guys. Okay, you have fun, all right? Hey, um, <laughs> that you spoke about, that you thought about those two other days that we spoke about previously, remember? 
No, not right now, no. Okay. I don't want to talk about that right now. Can we just, like, change her and then... Yeah, yeah. Um, um, I, I was just trying to, you know, have, like, a mutual agreement to cause... No, but no, there's no mutual agreement. We, no. Okay, so you want me to, uh, like, make a modification, like, request my friends? Or how should I do it? Yeah, if that's what you want to do, yeah. Okay. You, I mean, you know the process. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. You I know just, how it all works. I was just trying to communicate right. with you, that's all. Okay. See if, you know, if we could, like, uh, mutually agree on something, like, you know, but if, no. if we don't want to mutually agree, that's fine. No. Um, I'll just have my journey just, you know, file for another modification so I can get on more days. Okay. That's fine? Yeah, whatever. That, that's that's whatever you, cho you choose to do. That's not what I'm doing. Okay, okay. Thank you. Um, I'll have her back. Um, I, I was supposed to have her back by four. Yeah. You know, but we agreed already. Yeah. But um, can I have her a little later since it's past 12? Yeah, like four, yeah, 4 30, whatever. Okay. It's 12 21, so. Can I have her a little longer? Like how long? Um, maybe two. Huh? Maybe two. Two what? I mean, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's 12 I'm supposed to have her to 4. Okay, can I have her to like maybe 6.30 or 7? That's way too late because we go to bed early that time. Okay, what time? Just just play by ear. Just if she, like, just let me know at 4, at like 4 o'clock or whatever when she's doing. If she's still happy or whatever, then I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Okay? All right. Thank you. Yep. Say bye to mommy. Love you, baby. I'll see you in a little bit, okay? And be careful with her. Love you. Guys, she's looking at me. I feel bad. I don't like leaving her. And I honestly don't know why he still records because it's like, what are you recording for? Like, I'm not the one doing anything wrong. You are. All right, guys, I'm freaking out a little bit because I think I left my wallet in Amora's car seat. And that's with Jorge. God, dude, are you fucking kidding me? And that motherfucker is ignoring my calls like a piece of sh This sucks, dude. So, Jorge won't answer his phone now. I gave him a Mora, but... Here, this was... This was my mistake. I left my wallet in Amora's car seat and now Jorge's not answering his phone and I'm almost 100% sure he's not going to give me my wallet back. So, guys, this is not good. Jorge has all my credit cards and my driver's license and everything. Um, and he won't answer his phone. Look, this is what I have to deal with. You know... Jorge thinks that he's like getting like revenge on me or something, but really. He's just gonna accumulate more bad karma that he receives and that's really none of my business. That's between him and the universe, but he knows that he should do the right thing. Um, yeah, so he's not answering the door. He's not here, I guess. I don't know. He's not answering, you know. I'm not gonna stress though. I just want my wallet. It's in her car seat, Jorge. I tried to text you, you blocked me. It's in the car seat. 
Uh, pick her up. It has to be in there. Thank you. That's all you have. You know what? Don't even talk. Yeah. I would just take it first and head out. All right. Thank you. Right now, stay the fuck away. Don't come back over here. You will get made. Ethan, stop, right stop, stop, stop. And that's all he had to do was just answer my call and give me the wallet. And I wouldn't have had to go to his house or anything. <laughs> they love it. They love the drama. He wants it. It's like, dude, I just calmly, calmly tried to call and ask for my wallet back. You know, I accidentally left it in the car seat. And that has to turn into... So guys, um, I just finished pumping the gas. I put $40 in my gas tank because um, I was out of gas. And so that's how long that last time I in the vlog when I put gas in, that's how long that gas lasted me. So this van is very good on gas. I'm very happy about that. So guys, we're at the United States Post Office here in Erie, PA on Legion Road. We're on our way in to check the PO box, all right? I'm trying to keep my spirits up um you know oh sorry, sorry. considering <laughs> whoa considering um jorge <laughs> tried to trigger me again so yeah and he kind of did a little bit but not anymore hi guys so this is just a little um break during the vlog um i forgot to add the part where I got into my post office box, but the there was a note in there saying that I had bigger packages, and but the front desk was closed. So I didn't get the packages today, so I have to go tomorrow. And um, the next thing you're about to see is us, me and Ethan picking up Amora. I can't even talk, guys. It's been a stressful day, but here you go. Because you had my wallet and I answered your phone. Like I stole it from you. I mean, I see your wallet right there. Why was it on the roof? Like, you hit it down there. Really bad. Can I have a more, please? Yeah, I can give it to you. I just want to let you know that I don't know if you're aware about it. I was recording everything. I got you my security cameras. You know that you're not supposed to be in the house, right? For order. You know that's a violation on, on your... On your why, what, what are we talking about? Can I just okay. have a baby? I just want to let you know that Monday I'm going down with my ex-wife. They said to stay away from her. You know, she, that is her house. Jorge, come on, let me have the baby. Okay, so just you know, you are aware of that, right? And they said you cannot go near her mom's property, my property, or her property. And near her, that was written. No, actually, but, they didn't say that, but that's fine. So that's what her okay, can I have the baby? Okay, yeah, I, I just came to the, I just came to your house to get my wallet because you weren't answering your phone. Can I have the baby? Oh my God, Hori! Obviously, she didn't purposely put it there. I didn't. It was an accident. Yeah, why would I want it? Why would I want you to have my wallet? Hori, you're not making any sense. Can I please have the baby? Call the police. I'm trying to get the baby, and you're uh, you're starting an argument. Just give me the baby. Right, shut the hell up. Get no. the baby out of the car. Yeah, yeah. You, you get the baby out of the car. Well, listen, I don't have to get We're nobody not out of the car. Ethan, don't, because now he won't give me the baby. Just listen, stop. I don't have to get nobody out of the car. Why the fuck are you getting listen, that out? You're a man. Yeah, you're a You talk shit about her. You talk shit don't, about your Ethan, get away from you leave her. Your, you leave her. And give me the baby. You're talking shit about your ex-wife. You get with her. Ethan, yeah, just listen. stop. Just stop. Go get over the there. Away. Learn how to take a shower properly. Hey, hey, time. don't talk to my son like that. Shower last night. What are you talking about? Give me the baby. This is not how I want my baby. Go daughter. get back in there. Get all right? No, just get back Thank in there. Thank you, Ethan, for the little attitude. Have a good one, all right? Sound good? Have a good one. Jorge. You black my car or you get anywhere near I... my car? Listen, you black my car or get anywhere near the car. Okay, I will mace you and your son. Do it. You understand? I will give to you. Stay the fuck away. It's literally here Come on. morning. No, no. Got don't. I just let you know. Not well in the head. Get near my car. I will mace you, little boy. So I will, I will, I will mace you too. Get, listen. We've got to have to call the time. What are you talking about? Why are you giving me the. Why aren't you giving her to me? Because. 
What do you mean? You can't. No, no, stop, stop. Ethan, he's not mentally well, okay? He's not like us at all. He's not a. Just. Hey. Can I have the baby? Yeah, I knew he was gonna pull this. Yeah. I knew he was gonna. I'm not even gonna stress because he's just doing this to play games and honestly he's trying to get me to freak out so he can like be like oh she's crazy <sighs> so guys Basically, what I was just telling Ethan is I kind of already had a feeling that he was going to play this, but based on the way that he was acting earlier, um, I could tell that he was kind of just reaching. He was looking for a reason to get me upset. He was he was saying whatever he could to try to get me triggered. And um, so I already kind of had a feeling that when I met him at Country Fair, he was going to try to start another conversation and like then come up with a reason to fucking keep the baby. And so he did. And my theory is he's probably gonna like call me within like an hour or two and want to give her back because she's gonna be missing me. And what last time? another thing is too, I'm gonna have to find my breast pump now because now like obviously I, she should be breastfeeding right now and she's not. So there's that. And uh, yeah, so Jorge is just really just lost his mind, fully, fully lost his mind, guys. Um. You know, I would say just pray for people like this that are in this type of position that are clearly not mentally all the way there. Um, they got something going on or something's affecting them because that type of behavior is not right. The way he's acting is not even like the Jorge that I knew, like as weird as hell. So yeah, me and Ethan are here and that's that. I'm going to start editing this vlog and yeah. This dude is weird as y'all. That's scary. That's really scary. Zero. I cannot make this up, guys. This is scary, y'all. I cannot make this up, y'all. You see this? Dude is really, really wild. I'm trying to pull out of this uh, parking lot here because he had me meet him at the Wesleyville police station. And um, he's still like standing out there. Like, I don't know why, I don't know why he's doing that. Like he's still standing there. Like, I don't get it. Like. I'm not gonna say anything though, because. Because I'm not. Dude, I'm not giving a more to him tomorrow. F that. So, um, we're home after all that chaotic mess. Here's adorable little Amora. Say hi. Say hi. 
You're so silly and cute. Really? <laughs> You're so cute in them little jeans. Yeah, I'm gonna have to move that, huh? Because you're gonna try to knock that over, huh? He's making a pizza. He's making us a pizza. Aw. You babin? <laughs> say Ethan? Can you say Ethan? Yeah. So guys, I almost fell asleep and didn't get this out there tonight. So after this, I'm going to bed because I'm exhausted. Um, I'm not going to be giving him more to Jorge tomorrow. No, absolutely not. Not after all that. That's, that's insane. He can take me to contempt court. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Okay. I love you guys. And thank you for watching my channel and I'll see you on the next vlog. All right. Bye guys.